Everyone needs clean water. Our children will not survive without it. We will cause major health problems, um, neurological issues, and people will die in massive numbers. One of the huge issues is that we have just tremendous amount of pollution. And as much as we might like to think it won't invade our waterways, it is. So access to water is increasingly problematic and it's a major concern for human health. When water becomes scarce, it becomes something that could be commodified, right? So the more scarce it is, the more valuable it would be. And as soon as it becomes valuable and it becomes something that one country has and another country does not have, corporations rush in for ownership. That does not mean that's going to help anyone except for those corporations. So this leads to war, it leads to political conflict, it leads to trading that is not to the benefit of the people. So let's look at the bottled water industry. Here's a clear example of why we do not want water privatization and the problem with it. That water is being extracted from communities that need that water. So it's making money for a corporation. They're going and they're taking this water from a community, leaving them with less water in their aquifers and in their groundwater. In some cases, this is leading to desertification. And so we don't want to leave this in the hands of corporations because the goal of corporations is to make money. The goal of the government should be to take care of the people. And that's where water should be, in the hands of an entity that is there to safeguard the rights of human beings. In communities where we have low-income people, indigenous people as well, Latinx and Black Americans, they're the hardest hit with environmental contamination, and that includes water. When it becomes privatized, the fear is and the concern is that only the wealthy will be able to afford it. Even today, that's an issue. People can't pay their water bills, and when they can't pay their water bills, they, their water gets shut off. It's not right to put that burden on especially on poor families, and they carry a disproportionate burden of that and can't. So what ends up happening is they don't get access to it. I really believe deeply that it's our obligation, it's a moral and ethical obligation of the, of the government to make sure that our water is clean. So we must invest in this. We can just say, well, I don't care, but I, th I think that that's, I think it's immoral, I think it's wrong, I th and I think we're all culpable, and I think we all have a responsibility to act. Hey, NBC News viewers, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.